Hello, this is Ricardo Francis, the Venting Vigilante. It's good to be with you again today. Today I'm going to vent about fixed mindset and growth mindset. Many of us, on a daily basis, or for our entire life, we have a fixed mindset. We have a fixed way of doing everything in our life. We are one trapped mind. Or we have one way of doing things, we have one way of thinking about things. We do not look at different factors, different opinions. We do not share and entertain different opinions. We do not encourage different opinions, different views. We do not go about seeking new information, observing new information, looking at many different ways of doing things in our lives. So you continue to do the same things over and over, my friends, and you're going to get the same results. It's historically noted that way. There's a lot of things in history to properly demonstrate that. Even you as an individual, whomever you may be, sit back and you reflect. You will recognize, you will realize that you continue to do the same things over and over and you're going to get the same results. Someone with a growth mindset is someone who continues to grow. They continue to grow intellectually, spiritually, socially, politically. Continue to grow in terms of seeking new opportunities, new opinions, seeking new ways of doing things, new ways of living, new of entertaining oneself. A new way of exploring life. And you're finding the good things in life. Being able to, to see life for what life really is. You are become a seeker of knowledge, a seeker of information. So, when you have a growth mindset, you do not do things the same way all the time. So therefore, you'll get a different results. Of course, clearly speaking, there are standard ways of doing things in life. There is clearly a right way and a wrong way of doing certain things when it comes to, to standards and establishing standards. That is not the, the issue here, really. The issue is the determination, the designing, the engineering of the way we live and the way we go about our lives on a daily basis in making decisions, in responding to crisis in our life, in dealing with difficult situations, difficult circumstances. You, you have a fixed mindset, chances are you will deal with it with a fixed way of looking at things and the results will be the same and the same and the same. It's, it's the old, old, old cocky pants. Friends, it's good to have a growth mindset. It's good to continue to look at new ways of doing things, when you, especially when you seek advice of someone. There's always an A reason, a B reason, a C reason, a D reason, a E reason, an F reason, hypothetically speaking. And you should examine A reason, B reason, C reason, E reason, F reason. And they must all be justified. The consequences of why certain things should be done a certain way. This is when you start developing a growth mindset. Now, it's not a fixed mindset is one size fits all. I do not agree and I do not subscribe to that way of thinking. Basically, I subscribe to the, the, the what I call the factor syndrome way of thinking. They, you give me the different uh, options and you explain to me what are the consequences of these options and then I will exercise them accordingly based upon my own particular circumstances or your particular circumstances as, as the viewer, as the listener of, of my uh, particular videos. So friends, think outside the box. Develop a growth mindset. It's I love you. I love sharing these moments with you. See you next time.